Hey, it's Camille, and today I want to talk about the temperature cur temperature control mug, the Ember mug. This is the box right here. This was the gift that my sister gave me for my 30th birthday. This is a hundred dollar mug, and I want to tell you why it's so good and why I suggest that you get it. I really just believe in it, but I've been waiting to do a video on this for so long, and now that I am in my own little place near Branson, Missouri, it's time. So before we start, if you'd like this video and subscribe, if you'd like to see more products like this that I just absolutely adore. This is not a paid ad. I just thought, why don't I cover this? Because I've been living with it for a few months now. My mom has had it for years. We bought it for my mom for her like Mother's Day or um, Christmas or something like that. And since it's a high priced item, you can kind of be like, hmm, I wonder what I think about this. So I'm gonna tell you what I have found from the last around five months, four or five months using it. So. Here we go. So the story of how I got this mug. I got tired of microwaving my coffee so many times. And because I just really like hot food, I like hot coffee. So I went to the internet and I said, there's gotta be something that keeps your coffee hot. And the Ember mug came up. We decided to get it from my mom and she just loves it. She uses it all the time. And um, I had used it a few times whenever she had it. So for my 30th birthday though, I started thinking around that time, you know what, I would really like my own Ember mug. And then my sister, Haley, who was staying with me for uh, you know, 10, 12 years in uh, Camille and Haley, or music, um, she said, I'm gonna get you an Ember mug for your birthday. And I was like, I was just thinking that. And so they have three different colors. They have, this looks like bigger on this video. That's kind of more like what it looks like. Um, so. They have black, they have bronze, and they have white. And so I was thinking, well, maybe I'd want a black one. And then I thought maybe I'd want a 14 ounce. I think this is a 10 ounce one, um, which actually is great. And I love, I love that I have the 10 ounce one. So I was thinking black and 14 ounce might be better. Then I changed my mind without telling her. And she's like, oh, just make up your mind. And I thought, you know what? I really want the 10 ounce and I want the white. And then she went to Target and all they had was the 10 ounce white, only one left and she got it for my birthday. So the decision was made for me and I already, that's all I really wanted. So um, basically how it works is it has this little coaster charger plugged into the wall. This is how big the wall thing is, it has a little ember on it. And it has this little prongs that connect with the bottom of this mug. You turn the mug on and I guess I've, I've put the color to, um, and you can also turn it off if you want, hold it down for like three seconds or something if you want to turn it off and then preserve the battery. And then actually I just realized this, I could probably take it with me. They do have a travel mug that looks more like a regular tumbler with a lid, but that's also like a hundred and something dollars. And I just have not gotten the, the gumption to pay that much, but you definitely need this. So somehow you gotta get it. I've found them on eBay. I've found them um, used and things. I don't know, maybe maybe someone wouldn't mind getting it used. This is something else that was really cool about it. My mom had something go wrong with hers and she called the company and they replaced it for free. So that's really cool. Um, I also just dropped mine recently. I was actually kind of scared. So it's, kind of, it's a kind of heavy cup. I don't know how many, how much weight it is, but it should probably, maybe it will tell us. Um, no, not on the outside, it's probably on the inside. But, um, it's kind of heavy mug and so it has all these electronics inside of it but it feels great so on your phone you can see how charged up your mug is and so it'll just like go up 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 so you can basically without having it on the charger this will work for about an hour and a half now i often find that it does not last for two cups of coffee um it will last for one for sure and maybe part of my second cup but maybe i just drink coffee over a long period of time but it will continue to charge and work uh, if it's on the coaster. I've noticed, I don't know if it's user error or sometimes maybe it doesn't sync up with my phone or something, but um, once in a while it won't work, but for the most part it does. A little side note is you see these lines in here? I was wondering, cause my mom's cup did something similar. And so I thought maybe I should get a different color, but I think it might be because I've been using this on this cup, which is not the softest bristles in the world. But it wouldn't do that with like a normal like ceramic thing, you know? So I don't really know why that's happening. I've been using a little baby spoon, a little rubber spoon uh, to try to avoid that, but it didn't work. And so I guess I didn't realize I have to baby this more than I realized. Maybe it's in the instructions, I don't know. But such is life and I still love the cup. So this is something cool. 
Uh, one of my friends, I said, um, he came over and fixed my sink and um, he's like a, you know, mentor. And I gave him, uh, I gave him some coffee or something, tea in this mug. And I didn't tell him that it was a heating up mug because I just forgot and we were talking. And so, um, so then he was amazed the whole time drinking that it wasn't getting cold. And even down, he said to the lowest part, it was like still warm. And he was like, what is going on with that mug? Is that thing, you know, temperature controlled? And I was like, yes, it is. Um, I just totally forgot to tell you. And so he got to really experience it himself. And so hopefully he goes and gets one. So uh, I just love it. But you can actually change the color if you see. Well, let's see. I just turned it off. Okay. You can change the color. Is that on yet? Of this, so like pink, green, uh, purple, whatever. And it turns red whenever it is uh, getting low in battery. So it actually attaches to your phone, uh, like Bluetooth, and then you can decide how hot you want your cup to be up to 145 degrees. Um, so a downside to this is that whenever I like a lot of cream in my coffee, um, when I put it in and I just leave it, it can get like this filmy layer of coffee at the top if I don't drink my coffee fast enough. And so then I just take my little spoon and go like that and I get it out and I, wash it out in the sink or whatever. But I've noticed that if I have like more, like half and half, like if I like do espresso with a lot of milk, it's more like that. But if I just do like regular coffee with cream, I'm getting less of that result. But I think it still does that. I think I just still had that happen like yesterday. But if you just kind of keep drinking it, keep moving it along and don't just let it sit for too long. I think it's good. So, but doesn't, I don't know. I don't think it's a big enough con because I don't think there's anything that really replaces it. So what I also use is my Yeti. That's what I used for so long with my Yeti, but it didn't keep it hot enough um, for long term. So I actually really am interested in um, getting the tumbler version. So hopefully Ember sees this and wants to send me a tumbler and then I will do a review on that one too. But if not, I think you need one. There's different colors, different sizes. Um, I would definitely, uh, get one and they are just great. So that's my review. I hope you enjoyed it and I hope that you get one because if you like me don't like microwaves and you don't want to heat your coffee up three times uh, while you're drinking it because it has to be piping hot, then so far this is the best option uh, for keeping your coffee hot. So I'm going to see if I can do an affiliate link, which means if you buy it through my link, it blesses me a little bit from your purchase because they're like, oh, thank you, Camille, for telling people about our awesome mug. We're going to encourage you to keep doing that, that kind of thing. Thank you guys so much. My name is Camille. You can find my blog at camillesjournal.com. Um, find me here on YouTube and on Instagram at Camille Harris. God bless you. Subscribe. You'll see more videos of mine um, on my favorite products. And I also do uh, music and I do devotionals about God and um, go through the Bible. So, okay. Bye.